And you look at some of these one-on-one players like KD and Steph and Kyrie. Right now, as you and I have this discussion, who do you believe is the best one-on-one player in the NBA? I have to say it'll probably be KD. I, I don't think anybody can mess with KD at one-on-one. Seven foot, can shoot, can handle. I mean, he's, he's so lethal offensively. But we we got to have, see, we got to have that height. We got to have that height because Kyrie. That, that, I, I was just about to say that. I was just about to say that. I was just about to say that. But when we're talking one-on-one and, and, and not, if, if we're doing height-wise yeah. the, the class, Kyrie, man. <laughs> Kyrie got a bag, man. Oh, I'm talking about a very deep bag. Yeah. Very deep bag. Yeah, he got a Santa Christmas bag. He got one of those bags. <laughs> yeah, he got one of them bags. <laughs> hey, hey, he got a couple sacks that he got on his back, bro. He's carrying around. When you look at Kyrie, he got game from the three-point to the mid-range. Have you ever seen a man his size finish at the rim with either hand, kisses, the floaters, the, the fallaways? Like, have you seen anybody in your time and even now be able to finish like Kai can? Yeah, yeah. Rod Strickland. Wow. Rod, Rod Strickland was one of the greatest finishers at that size that I've ever seen. And he had handles too. And then, and I think that you know what's crazy. I think that's Kyrie's godfather. Okay. I think there's a relationship there right. between those two. Right. But yeah, straight, straight. Oh my God, he was he was one of the best at finishing around the rim and had the handles. You mentioned KD, and when people talk about one on one, they say KD. The guy's seven foot tall. He got three point range. He got the mid range pull up. He got the hezzy pull up. He doesn't really. He doesn't really try. He likes to like the mid range. You don't really try to get all the way to the rim, although he can. Besides the height, obviously seven foot tall makes you very unique. Besides the height, what makes KD so unique? Um, you, you start, Shannon. You can't leave out the height. <laughs> <laughs> you can't leave out the height because that was that's what makes him so unique. Is, is is he's seven foot and to be able to shoot the ball and be efficient that way. Yes. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, think about it. This man is shooting 50 some percent and it's mostly jumpers. It is. Right? It, like that 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 is insane to me. So I can't leave out the hype on KD because that is that's what makes him so unique and dynamic. You know what to do. Hit the subscribe button and become an official member of Club Shay Shay, where we do something before two something.